Hi there, this is a screencast for jQuery for designers. Um, it's to demonstrate how easy it is to take simple tab markup and make it dynamic. This is our, our page without any JavaScript running on it. Um, I've put a bit of CSS just to make it look like it's got tabs. When you click on the, the links, the href is, if you notice at the bottom, the href is pointing to the right div and the markup looks like this. So it's a container div, a UL with a list of links, and a, con a div with the tab container which is linked by ID to the href of the appropriate link. <coughs> Pretty simple stuff. The tasks we have are to, when this page loads, hide all the tabs and show the first one. Select the first actual tab so that um, it's highlighted and then hook the click event so that when I click on second it will show me the second tab and hide the rest of them and so on. So I'm gonna add our jQuery This syntax is the equivalent of this. It's just shorthand. <clears throat> it just means that when the document is ready, execute our code. So first thing I'm going to do is get a uh, store the tab containers. So I'm using CSS to target the the divs that I'm interested in and I'm asking for the direct descendant that match uh, the, div class, the div element. So I want to hide them all to start off with. I'm going to hide all of them and then show just the first one. So dot hide. I'm going to filter my selection. So currently my selection is all three of these, these divs down here. First, second and the third. If I filter it just for the first I can then show this one. Okay, so this is just a simple bit of chaining I've done. It in the first, the first selector gets all three divs. I hide them. It returns all three divs. I run it through this filter command, which only grabs the first one and shows it. So this is working, but I don't have. Uh, oh, it, it's it's hiding my tabs, and it's also jumping down when I click on first. So let's add on our click handlers. In fact, we can use the navigation. Yeah, this selector is actually wrong because if I have any links inside of the tabs, uh, it would also hook these click events. So we actually want it to be on the tab navigation. So that's better. Um, tab containers. Hide. So we hide all of them, and then we show the one whose ID matches the, the hash part of the href. So if I just do a console.log this, this within this function is uh, the actual A element that we've clicked on. So if we look at the console, I'll, I'll, I'll show you what, uh, what's inside there. So it's hidden the tabs because I've said hide containers. So we look at it, the href second. If you look at the DOM, uh, I believe we've got yeah hash so we can actually use this and because it starts with a hash as well we can use it as a real uh, selector so going back to our code I'm gonna do tab containers dot filter and I'm just gonna pass in this dot hash which 
you can see is hash second, which is an actual selector. So if I do hash second, even though it's hidden, it still still gives me the uh, the DOM element. Dot show. So it's showing the right tabs, but it's jumping down as well, um, because we're using the hash and the the idea of the div is it matches a hash. So we just do return false, and it tells the browser to to cancel its default action. So now we've got tabbing working. We want the the actual tabs itself to to show that it's selected. So, so I've got a class selected on the anchor. So what I can do here is this dot add class selected. That will add the selected class to to each tab I click on, but obviously it will get stuck on. So we need to remove it from all the others first. And we can do that by okay. We're almost there, but when we, when we start up, we haven't got the first tab selected. So I'm just going to do dot filter first dot click and there we go we've got basic markup and pretty simplistic uh, jQuery to do our job there the next screencast will show non-conventional tab markup with JavaScript and uh, where it doesn't follow this this standard UL div for each each uh, tab container. Thanks a lot.